I'd like to talk now about a very important concept uh, in sound. It's called ethos. E-T-H-O-S. E ethos is the distinguishing character personality of sound, an instrument of a scale or a mode. And basically, every instrument, especially melodic instruments, instruments that would allow you to play various notes, can construct an ethos. In the same way, major scale would sound happy, easygoing, lighthearted to some, whereas a minor scale might sound sad or romantic to others. Um, certain instruments have specific ethos. Um, I'm going to demonstrate now two different chimes. These are Koshi chimes. This is the Ignis or fire Koshi chime. And it has a collection of different notes in it. And the overall effect of all these notes would construct something that will induce or promote certain emotions in the listener. So it's very important to draw attention to the ethos, to the receiver. Listen to this chime as I play it and explore the ethos of the different notes contained within it. And remember that all of these notes have harmonic overtones as well. So as you play it, explore the sustained notes between the notes that you actually play as you're moving it around and let there be some sustain so that the person can hear the ringing of the overtones. And the ethos of this instrument some may hear as lighthearted, whimsical, um, feeling of curiosity or openness. Whereas this ch chimes <coughs> has a different kind of ethos because it has different notes contained in it. There's more a sense of yearning, lament, certain sadness, nostalgia. I'd like now to demonstrate the ethos on another instrument that's called sansola, which is basically a tiny kalimba glued on this piece, which is animal skin and wooden frame. Um, it has various notes that would also construct an ethos. And you can also play a wah-wah effect with this instrument by basically putting it on the surface and as you play it, you lift it to open and close 
this cavity that would generate the wow effect. This is another instrument that demonstrates the concept of ethos. It's a small mallet instrument called the Wing, made by a company called Free Notes. The way I'm going to play will explore the various notes that are contained in this instrument. And I'd like you to focus on the intervals between the notes. And I will demonstrate certain notes and combination of other notes. Sometimes I may play in a rhythmic way, sometimes in a more spaced out way, exploring the qualities of the different notes individually and in combination. It's important to play in a way that would promote introspectiveness and contemplative uh, state. 